Hi, this video is a presentation for the app Grade Slope Along Surface uh, by Red Transit Consultants. Uh, here we're going to demonstrate what uh, this command is capable of, of doing. So upon installation, you'll get the app button. It'll show up on the add-ins tab. And you go ahead and pick the button and then you'll uh, pick what surface to associate or that you're going to use for this command. So here I'm going to pick my existing surface and now I can enter in a slope uh, or a grade at a specific point. So I'm going to pick this point here and you can see it's starting with 8%. Um, default is 2%. This is just storing my recent value um, that I was uh, using in this drawing. But what this command does is it uses a unique algorithm that takes each triangle's slope and then computes the angle based off of that algorithm uh, across that triangle for the angle of where that exact slope would be. Um, so here in the command line it's actually asking you to pick a direction. So you can pick one side or the other and it'll process. Or you can say grade or slope to adjust the angle. So if I say grade, I want uh, a 2% grade. You can see the, the um, arrows updated. If I say grade negative four, you can see that now it's going to go downhill from that point. So I can pick anywhere um, I want there. For this, let's go grade four percent, and I'm going to pick on this side. <clears throat> and now we have our line. Now, if you look at the line, there's limited vertices on it. If we follow that line, it's just a 3D polyline. It takes it up to the top where that four percent. Uh, is now if I come in and turn on the surface triangles you can see that the grips of the 3D polyline are directly at the edges of the uh, triangles so that it, it is you know computing exactly um, to what the surface data is across it. If I take that 3D polyline and I turn it into a feature line, and then go to Elevation Editor, you can see everything is exactly 4%, exactly, exactly what you entered in. So it's very powerful in what it, um, what it can quickly provide you uh, for surface data. If I go ahead and run it again, we'll just play around with a couple different options here. I'm going to go from the same point and let's say I want to go uh, grade 2% and go this way. You can see it's generated that line there for us and it's following around until it finds a triangle where you know it can't achieve that grade um, and so uh, that's where it'll it'll error out and and stop and just plot the line so um, again if we pro turn this into a feature line you can see it's exactly two percent so um, very beneficial tool, uh, helpful in our grading designs that we do uh, to be able to find this exact spot uh, along a surface um, quickly. Uh, and you can see how quick it processes and it's it's tied to the surface as far as lining up with the, with the triangles. Um, it's not a dynamic line, so if the surface changes, this line will have to be updated, but it is closer to, to that aspect. So thanks for watching.